Hey, what is up guys? It's your boy Polaric coming at you with a brand new video and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix and identify where your packet loss is coming from. So sometimes the Fortnite servers are a little shaky and most people do get packet lost every now and then and it won't be too consistent. However, some people are experiencing consistent packet loss and whether they're e still on Ethernet when they shouldn't be having any packet loss. Um, there's a couple different things you can do um, once you identify where it is it really depends um, but yeah guys the first thing we're gonna go ahead and do is figure out how to identify where that packet loss is coming from so the first thing you want to do is go into the bottom left type cmd click to run as administrator go ahead and click yes this window is going to pop up go ahead and type ip config click enter what you're looking for is this default gateway so you see my default gateway is 192.168.01. What you want to go ahead and do is on the next line, you want to type ping and then you want to type that default gateway. Basically what this is going to do is it's going to test your own PC to see if your packet loss is in fact from you or if it is the servers. So you're going to go ahead and type ping space the default gateway space um, minus n space 25 click enter what this is going to go ahead and do is it's going to send 25 individual packets to your router and back um this will tell you if the packets are on your end or if it's on the game's end the internet's end or your internet ser uh, service provider's end so you see all these different packets coming in um it tells you how big they are um the latency it has and as you can see, I have 0% packet loss. Um, I sent 25, received 25, and it tells you the average latency. So that's not too bad. Um, that's pretty good. So you can tell I don't have any packet loss problems to my router. So if this is good and you know you're still experiencing packet loss, the next thing you want to go ahead and do is you want to go ahead and test and see if it is your network connection or network congestion, uh, meaning that there's too many devices connected. It is too hard for your signal to get out of your router to your internet service provider. Um, so what you want to go ahead and do is you're going to go ahead and do like in google.com and I'm sorry, negative in 25. So this is going to send 25 packets to google.com, which they do have historically um, reliable servers. Um, most these are really stable servers. Um, they're highly reliable and there shouldn't be really any congestion so if you're not getting any packet loss from here then you know it is not on your end and it is on fortnite if both of these are zero percent packet loss so as you can see i have zero percent zero percent packet loss meaning that i don't have any packet loss on my end meaning my internet should be perfectly fine and then it tells you how long um it took those packets to get there and back so once you're there um, you can kind of just tell. Um, so this um, to google.com is basically from your internet to Google servers. So if it is, if your packet loss is a problem from your internet to Fortnite, then you'll know by it not coming out up here, you'll have 0% packet loss up here when you pinged yourself and you'll have 0% packet loss here. However, if you still do have packet loss here, and that's where it started you know you have network settings that are wrong on your pc either that or you were you are running on wi-fi and in that case you want to go ahead and start investing in ethernet and then if you are getting uh being or ethernet problems here i'm sorry if you are getting packet loss here you might want to look into a vpn it could be your isp's routing your internet service provider but yeah guys once you've done that one thing you can do that does help most of the time 90 percent of the time you go ahead and type in the bottom left, reset network. Uh, it's called network reset. So go ahead and search network reset, click enter. Basically what this is gonna do, as it says, it's gonna uninstall and install all of your network adapters, drivers, everything. Basically it's gonna give you all new default addresses. It's gonna give you everything brand spanking new. And it should be the most stable that it, you're able to get um, based on Windows. It's going to be basically like you just installed Windows. So if that doesn't work, then you know it can't be your PC or it could be faulty hardware and that you might need to get a new physical 
um, network adapter. Um, but yeah, guys, that's pretty much been it for the video. It's been real. I do appreciate all the support I've been getting lately. If you guys don't mind, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe on the video for more FPS vids and internet vids like this. I do appreciate you all. I love you. Make sure you use code player in the item shop. Peace.